folks, today's video is another box opening. It's the Toby Friends Beeper. Moves. Music and sounds make Beeper move. Lights up. Features glowing LED lights. Reacts. Responds to other Toby Friends. And here's the exciting bit, folks. Interacts works with the Toby Robot smartwatch. So as some of you folks probably know already, we got two Toby smartwatches last year and we found them really entertaining. So when I saw this, I saw that it interact with the Toby smartwatch. I thought I've got to try this. Its retail price is £18 or $18 but amazon had an offer on so this little fella just cost me 11 pounds so without further ado let's get this little fella out the box instructions Must be the battery box. Interesting. Got a couple of cable ties. That's odd. This wire appears to be tied in a knot. I don't know what you're supposed to do here because uh, we got this wire going through the cardboard. So are we supposed to tear the cardboard? get that out I'm not sure I think I better look at the instructions it's most odd this is really strange temporary battery box before you begin the temporary battery box connected to your Toby friend is for indoors demonstration and must be removed before playing to enjoy the full interactive experience how odd so the whole black plastic unit there is Sur surplus to requirements it's almost as big as toby friends one remove the screw and battery compartment cover from the temporary battery box two remove the batteries from, from inside the temporary battery box and dispose of them close the compartment cover and discard the temporary battery box i'm sure that will come in useful yeah, we can use it in a project, that's true. Remove the tab from under your Toby friend and discard. Yeah, that's a good point, that, Paul. I mean, um, you know, you have to pay money to buy battery boxes and they are handy things to have, aren't they? Yeah. Paul might, yeah. Pull one tag out, pull the other tag out. Okay. And what about this battery box, which is connected into the bottom of Toby? which is said to be temporary. Do we remove it? it looks like a plug there. Oh, it's a plug, is it? Mm -hmm. Right. Hey, that's handy. So you've got a battery box that's already got a plug on. Well, I've never seen that before in a toy. So no. that entire box, battery box, and batteries are all temporary. But the thing is, somebody could always put the battery box on eBay because they are useful in the cells for people building projects. Yeah. But you said that battery box is actually better quality than some that you can buy. Yeah, I mean, if you to buy a battery box, uh, it will, sometimes they're not as good a quality as, as, as this one, which is completely enclosed with a screw-on lid. And it's been and free with an £11 toy. Mm. Amazing. So he started to make uh, sounds. So he must have some button cells in them, but um, they probably need changing, don't they? Interact with your Toby friend. Your Toby friend will interact back and forth with you in its own language while lighting up and moving its head. Ensure the switch under your Toby friend is in the on position. Press the button on top of your Toby friend to start interacting. Speak, play music, clap or make any noise close to the microphone to interact with your Toby friend. Right, let's see if we can get a reaction. <laughs> nice 
and uh, zippy. So I'm not going to raid the interact with other Toby friends because we haven't got another Toby friend. But what we have got is a Toby smartwatch. <laughs> and sure the switch under your Toby friends is in the on position and that your Toby smartwatch is on. Try these functions on your Toby robot smartwatch to see how your Toby friend responds to the sounds. Swipe left, swipe right or left. Okay. didn't seem to get a reaction from the uh, the Toby friend Paul. Yeah. Replacing the batteries. He takes six button cells. That's a lot of button cells. So we've put some fresh batteries in just in case uh, that's made a difference. I would say that's a bit louder. Yes, I would say it's a bit louder as well. Let an alarm or timer go off. So I'll put a timer on the Toby watch and see if there's any sort of reaction to that. So he made a noise all the time the timer was on and stopped when the timer finished. Paul, uh, his lights are, are very bright and he's quite quiet. But if you change the batteries, put new ones in, there's a definite difference. Mm. So I'm going to try and make Toby dizzy again. Oh, yeah. Uh, there was a lot stronger reaction there, Paul. Well, that was a definite reaction there. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to um, play with this over the next few days and uh, see if I find any interesting reactions and see what I think of, of it after a few days. Uh, can't expect a whole lot for 11 quid, can you? No, I, it, it didn't really impress me, but uh, I can see. Uh... <laughs> 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 I can see some value of having a Toby friend to go with your Toby smartwatch because uh, when because Toby the Toby smartwatch does make some sounds by himself, doesn't he? When you just leave him alone, and if you leave him next to the Toby friend, the Toby friend responds. And watching them from a distance, that that can be quite amusing. Yeah, I'll try and get some some footage of that because I want to do a follow up um, video. It was a bit crazy having the battery box. Very odd having this uh, this sort of uh, temporary battery box plugged in. I mean, we know why. It's so that the batteries last and the, and the test me function when it's mm. in the shop so mm. people can try it out, but it's still a bit odd. Mm. And it, we did wonder how long the, uh, the little button cells are going to last in the yeah. Toby friend. One of the things I'm going to do is I'm going to try and uh, get a bit of footage of the Toby friend um, on an evening mm. when it's a bit dark mm. and uh, see see what he looks like, you know, when, yeah. when it's a bit yeah. bit dark, see what the lights look like. On. We'll see what we think after a few days in our follow-up video. So folks, that's it for this video. Hope you enjoyed that. And we'll see you next time for another update.